Dr. Banerjee, could you tell us more about the genesis of Corporate Smart Program and how this is beneficial for professionals in the new economy, in the new business environment? Um, so in an ever-changing um, business environment, uh, especially with the kind of disruption that we've been seeing over a period of time, so there's actually been an era of disruptions really, you know, and the culmination of that has really been what we experienced last year. But in an ever-changing environment of disruption, I think what is most valuable for organizations is to be able to have employees who have a point of view, who are able to make meaning, make sense of this change in the environment, who have voice, who have the ability to be able to share ideas, views, opinions, to be able to solve problems differently, and to bring the much needed agility that organizations want in the in terms of speed of performance within organizations. And if you look at what, what has transpired over the last one year, this has clearly been uh, not only one of the most adverse disruptions that we've experienced, uh, but this disruption has also been full of incredible opportunities. And I think what Corporate Smart is attempting to do is through its research, um, through the insight that it's got from so many sources, so many focus group discussions, and the rest that we did all through last year, is we have an incredible uh, body of insights uh, provided by various uh, stakeholders, whether it's um, entry-level talent, uh, mid-level talent within organizations, um, CXOs across industries, um, CEOs across industries, uh, academia uh, that came in to offer these perspectives, uh, which has allowed us to be able to put together this very outstanding, this very distinctive set of offerings called Corporate Smart. So Corporate Smart is in fact becoming disruption smart. Um, it's in fact uh, becoming the embodiment of what Taib called anti-fragility. And so uh, the idea of Corporate Smart emanates from creating um, a group of professionals through the capability building route who have the gravitas, who have the maturity to be able to make sense of this changing environment, um, to be able to uh, prepare themselves um, for the opportunity to be able to use these insights meaningfully, uh, to indeed, uh, you know, sort of give wind and um, to accelerate the process of being able to have leadership at all levels within the organization. Um, and not just talk about it, but to actually build capabilities across the organization. To also bring in the right kind of perspectives at the top leadership level and to bring forth and manifest the kind of leadership that these times require, that these times demand. And so Corporate Smart is a very timely intervention. It has um, six very well-defined intelligences and they, each module uh, is around each of these intelligences, which is so key to be able to become this professional uh, who is ready and prepared for the new economy. Each of the modules constitute three sessions each, and so this is an outstanding suite, a very timely research-based suite of 18 sessions, um, which um, professionals uh, across levels um, junior to mid, mid to senior, senior to top levels within organizations must be exposed to uh, so that organizations are um, investing in the right kind of capability building that can help professionals uh, to become disruption friendly, can, which can help professionals to be confident in the face of the next disruption which is around the corner, which allows people to feel confident to be able to remain high performing even through times of adversity and disruption. And so uh, Corporate Smart is a very important solution and I recommend strongly that organizations across industries explore the value of Corporate Smart and use this to be able to invest in the right kind of capability building for professionals within their organizations.